baby girl, I'm gonna take it slow. Okay, y'all. Another day, another dollar. I'm on my way to get my daughter from school right now. So, y'all, um, I've been meaning to talk to y'all, but I'm gonna have to talk to y'all on a different note and in a different video because I've been liking. Your girl been liking, and I need some video ideas. I need different things to do, and I'm lost on what to do, y'all. So, and I don't want to eat my life away, but I think I'm gonna just turn my channel into a mukbang, mukbang channel. Or a challenge channel or a prank channel. I don't know. But um, I want y'all to stay stay in there with me. <laughs> Just stay with me. Okay, y'all, look. I want y'all to take go uh, run a couple of errands errands with me today because you know I've I been missing y'all and I've been needing somebody to talk to. You know, y'all the only people that I can talk to right now because Kevin he don't listen to me. He do not listen to me. My mama she don't listen to me or she's talking over me. My daughter she stay up in her room so you know I need somebody to talk to so why not talk to y'all? Um, I want y'all to go up in this store with me real quick. I'm finna get some stuff for this challenge that I'm about to get ready and do. I'm gonna be doing the um the uh apple apple and mustard challenge i know i know right apple and mustard challenge i'm gonna be doing that today and i'm gonna have that posted but that's gonna be in a whole nother video y'all so i want y'all to stay tuned for some more videos um i'm also doing another challenge i'm making up a challenge well it's really something that i always had i always ate like um what you call it? Mexican corn. I always ate Mexican corn or whatever. So, I'm going to do a challenge. And the challenge is you got to eat five corns. Whole corns. Not the um, the, corn on the, the corn on the cob. You got to eat five whole corns. Not the little ones, but the big ones. But if you want to break it down to five little ones, you can do that. But it's going to be five corn and five minute challenge. I know y'all... If you never had Mexican corn before, you're going to love it. So, it wouldn't bother you not a bit. Just It's just the point of getting that five down in five minutes. Okay? So, y'all participate in that challenge. In the video, I will be doing some um, shout-outs. And, and I will also tag some people in the um, that I want to do the challenge. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned for the rest of that. Okay? Come on up in this store with me. Let's see what we can get. I got to get some Parmesan cheese and what else? Uh, apples. Gotta get apples. Okay, y'all. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So, y'all, I made it up in here. And I'm trying to pick out which apples I want because it's like they got so many different kinds. One for $1.67, one for $1.77, $0.94, cent, and one ninety-seven. So, I'm trying to pick out, figure out which one is the best. We just gonna grab two. Okay. I done made it at a Walmart, so now I am on my way to get Kevin from work, him and my mom. Yeah, they work at the same place. Kevin is my mom's boss. Like, how does that work out? My mom is bossy. And I don't think that's going to work out just fine. But they've been doing <laughs> they've been doing good together, though. They've been almost working together for almost a year now. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to pick them up from work right now. And uh, back to the house I go. And Kevin, he finna get ready to start this uh, orientation. He's going to orientation today for truck driving classes. So, we're going to see how that go. Pick him up. He got to go get dressed. Go home, get dressed. And then he got to go straight to the um, to the place. So, yeah, we're going to see how that go. Praying for my baby. I know he got it. He got this. He got this. This is something that he really wants. So, we're going to make sure he stick to it. And, you know, yeah, y'all. It's, it's nothing but blessings and, you know, all that good stuff going on around here. So, we're trying to stay, we're trying to stay committed to what we want, we really want out of life. So, it's stuff that we talk about all the time as couples, you know how we do. We sit up and talk about the things that we want, so it's just up to us to stick to it and go, go for what we really want. So, I hope he sticks to this. I'm going to make sure he sticks to it. I ain't gonna say I'm gonna make sure like that, but I'm gonna just like try to make sure that he 
doing what he's supposed to be doing. And he's gonna make sure I do what I'm supposed to be doing. So, yeah, yeah, stay tuned. Look, we at Buffalo Wild Rings right now. I'm about to get ready to go in here and test some stuff up on this Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's we about to go down. down. Mm -hmm. Buffalo Wild Wings. Baby, the one to his class is. Um, I know it's kind of dark here. Let me turn the lights on. See if you get a little light. Okay, it's, it's a little light. But he went to his uh, orientation class. And how you say it, go, baby? Uh, for the CDL program for truck driving more than less uh, I start Monday uh, my first class they got like a uh, before you actually take the CDL class training class you have to go through a process uh, for um, I think a couple weeks or something you gotta go through this little class to teach you how to um, be presentable at interviews and stuff like that like life uh, lessons and uh, teach you different stuff about life, life lessons more or less. Right. Um, people with like attitude problems and stuff, they kind of uh, they address them. Like people with bad attitudes, show you how to overcome all of that and be a nice person and be cheerful more or less in this class before they let you take the actual class. You have to actually go. Before to, you take your CDL class? Yes. For real? You got to actually. Uh, do uh, two hours a day for like a couple weeks or like three four weeks or something like that whatever it is um, you got to go from 9 to 11 um, you got to do complete that first and then you get to go to the CDL pro program or start your CDL program and that actually takes four weeks the first week is going to be in class three weeks the last three weeks we're going to be actually hands-on driving the semi truck that's my okay. goal so and actually uh, this program is pretty cool because it's not just for people that's trying to drive trucks uh, it's say for instance if you don't have a high school diploma uh, you, or GED, GED they, they pay for you they pay for you to go to GED for the GED program uh, construction they got a construction working pro program like all trades of like construct roadside construction type stuff right. it's actually a great program um, and it's ba uh, the program is for actually uh, I hate to say it but uh, for black people um, they said in the class 70% uh, of uh, they want 70% uh, of black people to go through this program instead of Caucasians because um, Caucasians are a minority um, and have better jobs right now they want to try to help the black community oh, okay. so that's, that's what this up. is seven they want 70% so yeah there's going to be a couple white people in there that 30% you know but they want 70% of uh, this program is for for, for for the blacks yeah African Americans Okay. So yeah, yeah, it's, it's cool, man. Learned a lot of stuff, man. So uh, they're the number tenth, uh, ten program in uh, in uh, the whole Illinois. They're uh, number ten out of like I think like fifty programs. They're number ten. Um, they're going to be presented with a with a plaque here pretty soon. Mm -hmm. um, they have the Hold this real quick. This pretty much present themselves um, to some organizations. And uh, they could be potentially be number one with um with their uh, program. And uh, after you graduate the class, they're a uh, hundred percent on finding people jobs. So if you pass the class, you're guaranteed to get a job more or less. Yes, it's lit. It's lit. Yes. Hey, baby said it's lit. It's lit, y'all. It's lit. Yep. All you got to do is complete the class, and you have a job. Yeah, and, that's uh, they, what's up. Uh, that's a nice program. I got so it. So y'all get in tune with that. And what is it online? Do they go? Like to different cities or just like here? Uh, they're gonna start branching out right now. I think it's like more Illinois. Okay. Um, like I said, uh, the, they had a guy to come in to do hiring for a uh, union. Mm -hmm. Uh, they got jobs right now for truck drivers making eighty-one dollars an hour, three thousand dollars a week. Um, he uh just got a grant for forty-six billion dollars. For all, he just got a forty-six billion dollar grant contract to fix the roads in uh Illinois. So they're looking for a lot of help right now. Forty-six billion dollars to fix these roads and stuff. They need truck drivers. They need construction workers. They need it all right now. Okay. And they're, that's what they're pushing for right now. And that's why this program is being made. Uh, we talked about two hours a day. It's pretty cool, man. They oh, and they pay you. They actually pay you ten dollars an hour. Why are you going through this class? 
For real? Yes. Ten dollars. Okay. You do forty hours a week. They pay you ten dollars an hour to go through whatever whatever you go through. If you do CDA or construction, they're gonna pay you to do it. Oh, yes. that's what's up. Yes. That's what's up. Ten dollars hour. a week. Yeah, forty hours a week. Just Y'all like get it too. We're going to probably put some links in the description, like uh, the name of the school or whatever, if y'all is in this area, so y'all can check it out. Yes. But that's nice. That'd be good lit. for the black community. We need it, y'all. We need it. Yes. But yeah, yeah, we finna get on up in here in this Buffalo Wild Wings. Felonies and all. Felons and all. Yep. We out there. Okay. Yeah, because my arm hurt. We can finish this conversation in just one second. But yeah, we finna get in here in um, Buffalo Wild Wings, y'all, so I'll see you in a sec. Y'all like my little furry? I like it. It's cute. Make it look all coffee in the wintertime. I love the wintertime. It look cute in your coats and stuff. Who else look? Uh, little wintertime. Look at baby. Y'all got on my hat shoes. I, I don't even want to show y'all this. I'm so ghetto. I am so, so freaking ghetto. I got on booties and hat shoes. Because I'm... I was comfortable at home doing a, another video. I was doing another video. They might got our music in here, so I'm gonna turn this off. Yeah, so we made it up in here. It's a lot of people. Baby, what you getting? I don't know. I don't know. Well, yeah, I know it's uh, Chicken Tuesday. So we're gonna be getting some shit in the house. Shit, shit. Yeah. Uh. This is a teriyaki. I mean, uh, Brazilian center. Oh, that's a hit. 